افتد عزم ایرانی رو به خورشید تلاوت که لرزه بد بود صبح سخت تر این شب پهنه کبیر فرا رسیده و قبلها کم کم آماده به رزم می شود حاصل روزها تلاش ترین شرایط آب و هوایی خم به ابرو نیا علم و تخصص و تعهد را به عرصه نمود دفاع آوردند پاسخ کوبنده بده Now, developing story this evening, Syrian rebels have reportedly rolled out the big guns and it appears they're made in America. Security sources claim Washington's been secretly supplying advanced anti-tank missiles to what they consider moderate militant groups. Let's get some live comment on this, find out what's happening. Moneyport Nyers in New York with the details. If this is true, how much of a game changer is it going to be? Well, if these reports are true, it would be a significant, if not the biggest, game changer for the Syrian conflict. Here is why. The weapon we're talking about is a heavy anti-tank, optically tracked, wire-guided BGM-71 Tau. Now, this monster of a U.S. weapon can pierce through 50 millimeter thickness of Syrian tank armor and Syrian fortifications from four kilometers away. Now, according to Depka File, an independent news website, the advanced U.S.-made weapon is in the hands of two rebel groups, the Free Syrian Army and the Free uh, Syrian Revolutionary Front. This development has not been confirmed by U.S. officials, but we do know that Washington considers both rebel groups as moderate, and both groups have repeatedly requested to be armed with these type of weapons. Now, the problem is, uh, many experts right now say that nearly half of all uh, Syrian rebels are jihadists or hardline Islamists. That means that uh, if these uh, these heavy weapons are in Syria right now circulating, there's a good chance that uh, the anti-tank tank missiles can end up in the hands of terrorists. Secondly, uh, the heavy artillery could also uh, be used to target civilians in civ uh, civilian uh, areas, such as uh, hospitals, homes, uh, cars, or even public transportation. Another fear is that the anti-tank missiles uh, can one day be used against the U.S. and its allies. Now, a video clip entitled Syrian Rebels Using American-Made BGM-71 Tau Anti-Tank was uploaded on YouTube on April 5th. It shows the weapon being fired by one man, uh, ultimately uh, hitting a home, what appears to be a home, and while other uh, people off camera are heard repeatedly saying uh, Allah, Allah Akbar. Now, according to the Depka file, uh, Saudi Arabia, with permission from the U.S., is supplying uh, the U.S.-made anti-tank missiles to the Syrian rebels. So if this uh, is ultimately confirmed, it will be a significant game changer there. As you say, Marin Port in New York. Thanks for the update there. Appreciate it.
ты у меня там стопы.